Hello everybody and what is going on? Welcome back to another episode of Area 32. That is right guys, back to the war based charity series where I am definitely not evil. Definitely not evil. Uh, but anyway guys, so we have some important stuff to go over. Step one, someone has been to my base. Okay, someone has been here, gotten through all the warding I put down, and somehow managed to kill off my golem. I don't know if it killed them first, I don't know if it took the multiple tries, but I don't know. My golem is not here, meaning it's dead. Meaning, I have to up the security. Meaning, if someone comes in, there's no way they're killing all my golems. I'm going to, in the next, well, as, after I'm done recording this, I'm going to tell you guys this. I am going to make so many golems, there is going to be at least ten on every floor that are going to guard each and every floor. Meaning, to get through this base, you would have to kill five times however many floors there are, ten times however many. Anyway, they also put a lucky block here, which I found to be kind of odd. And I, I, half of me wants to break it, but the other half of me is afraid it will blow up. So, we're gonna break it. See? It was just XP. It wasn't even bad. So, whoever they were thought they were being a little tricky and doing something like that. And I have my guesses to who it is. I, I have my guesses to who would do such a monstrosic type act. And it really is obnoxious, I'm not gonna lie. And because of their obnoxiousness, they've picked a fight with the wrong person. You see, I am the guy who has all the wands, the wands that can explode, the wands that can ca wreak havoc on this world. And they're messing with the wrong guy. <laughs> They are messing with the complete wrong guy, so I'm going to make them pay. And before we do that, though, I must talk to you guys that um, you guys told me about how to use the Nine Hells Wand. So if I right-click a pig, you're going to see that spawns bats that will actually kill them. See that? So it's you see the bats now attacking um, the pig. There we go. And it kills the pig, and then the bat dies. Um, and I actually get the bat's drop as well, and the bat drops sulfur. So it's basically also a finite way to get sulfur. Um, and this will work on people, too. So whoever that was is going to regret it. This pig is on the edge of the world border. Okay, well, luckily my, my, my thing will attack you. Uh, so what we're going to go ahead and do, guys... Did, did the bat explode? I don't know. Yeah, it looks like it did. Anyway, um, what we're going to be doing, guys, is first we're going to be taking a guess at who did this to us. We're going to look at the clues and figure something out. I've narrowed it down to a few people as is. Obviously, it could be Snake, but I have my doubts about that, and I'll tell you why. If Snake Doctor were to do something like this, he would have gone above and beyond. I know Snake. He doesn't play the tricky game. He plays the straight-out brawling game. I'm not stupid. Plus, the voice in my head told me it wasn't Snake. Right, voice in my head, it wasn't Snake? Exactly. See, the voice in my head even said it wasn't Snake, so it can't be Snake. What it is is, guys, the voice in my head doesn't want to tell me exactly who did it, but he did narrow it down to a select few people. He narrowed it down to either being Jimmy, Aaron, or Tyser, or Chatch. So it's one of those three people, all of which I know where they live. So we're going to stop by each of their houses, starting with Chatch, then going to Aaron, and then going to, well, to Jimmy. So we'll, 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 we'll go in that order. We're going to go to their bases and try to figure out who did this. So let us head there, and then we'll be back. Okay, everybody, so we are at Chatch's base, and he has this nice little thing sitting here. He hasn't taken the iron blocks from. But if we go down here towards his base, ha, 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 this is just the beginning. You will feel you will feel pain like nothing else. Rye guy, Rocky, and then it says Tyser. What? Wait, wait, I didn't put that there. Someone's, someone's framing me. <laughs> Someone's actually framing me. They can't and I'm guaranteeing it's the same person who tried to play their little trick on me They're trying to trick chat and trick me someone is playing a very deceptive game folks And we are gonna figure out exactly who this person is because it, obviously it's not chat because why would chat do it to his own base? I'm gonna go ahead and break in here I'm gonna break into Chatch's good old bit. Doesn't chat live here chat. Where's your base Is it here? Did someone fill this all up with cobblestone wasn't this his staircase? Someone filled up his entire staircase with cobblestone, I think. Oh my god, this is obnoxious. I want to get down to Chatch's base, but god, it's so... Oh my god. Someone... Who would do this? This is like worse of a crime than anything I've committed. I'm not saying I'm a good person because, I mean, we all know I'm, I'm totally the nicest person in the world. But like, oh my god, this is annoying. Okay, let's just head down here. We don't even have to break all of them. I forgot. I'm in this form where I'm one block big, so I can just do every other. I just build straight across and down. That, that should work. Come on. When am I going to get into his base? His base has got to be around here somewhere, right? I hear water. And I remember there was lava. There was lava involved in his base. There's some quartz or something right there. I don't even know. Here's his base. God dang, that took a while. His base is empty. Except for some chests. And it looks, it looks like he left some junk behind. But it looks like he's long gone. 
So I don't even think I know where Chatch Yeah, there used to be a cactus farm here. I don't think Chatch is here anymore. I think Chatch has moved. I think Chatch is completely gone. Well, if Chatch is gone, we might as well go ahead and uh, do a little practice with our wands here. Just get some nice explosions in. Make it look like this place has been, you know, griefed by a, a nice human, you know? And then we're going to go ahead, blow it all up. And put Tyser. I swear, I, I hope he wanted to leave this stuff behind. I didn't mean to blow up his stuff. Anyway, no big deal. Just keep casting this everywhere at this point. There we go. Perfect. And actually, we'll collect some of this stuff. Is any of it donator items? I don't want to blow up his donator items. So as long as it's not donator items, I'm not really caring too much. So uh, store all that stuff. Actually, I'll keep the zombie brains. That comes in handy for a lot of the stuff I do. Um, we Actually, we'll keep the cobble. Don't need the sticky stuff. Thorns. Don't need that stuff. Don't need that stuff and none of this is donator items correct okay as long as he, none of this is donator items i really don't care um there we go just get some explosions in here there we go perfect perfect he doesn't live here anymore anyway so it's not a big deal or it doesn't look like he does there we go so perfect. we've destroyed this place pretty well i think and where's the last torch there's a torch somewhere that's lighting this place unless it's the lava oh it could be that torch back there lighting everything up we don't want any light yeah, I think it's all coming from the lava, so there's nothing we can do. Anyway, so we've proven that it was not Chatch who did it. Because why would Chatch lie about his own base about me? That doesn't make much sense. I'm going to assume there was another sign here that I accidentally broke that said Ticer. So I'm going to take a guess and say he was the one who did it. That's that's just a guess, though. There's no actual factual proof behind that. Let's go check out Ticer's base. Because I don't think I've shown you guys in a video that I know where his base is. So let's go do that. Okay, everyone. So now I know I'm at Tyser's base because there's a lucky sheep. And as I went over here, there was this monstrosity. A minion necro name. That thing, this is going to be revenge for killing my wonderful golem. He kills my golem. I crash the entire server. So I'm not going to lie. I really have no idea what just happened there. All I know is I was shooting some weird demented thing for as revenge to avenge my... Uh, to avenge my, what, what you might call it? My, my, <laughs> my golem, I couldn't think of the name. And it's gone, like I, I, I killed it and it probably that's what crashed the server, but I could kill his wolf too, but I don't know. I have a soft spot for wolves. There's nothing I, there's nothing I could do to a wolf and feel proud of. If I were to kill that thing, I would, I would feel bad. Um, but we are gonna get revenge on Aaron because I'm almost positive it's him at this point. Many of you guys, uh, I went through my comment section while the server was down. And many of you guys are saying it was him, but that, wait a minute, maybe not. Maybe not. Same person did the lucky block thing to me, also did the lucky block thing to him, it looks like. Which means it wasn't Aaron? I'm so confused. So if it wasn't Tyser, and his base is all flooded, and there's cactus... What is going on? Wall? Oh, these are just names. And there's cactus... Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We need to figure something out here. There's lucky blocks everywhere in here. Okay, well, let's go through step by step. There is lucky blocks legitimately everywhere in here. Someone did it to me. Someone did it to... It looks like Tyser now, too. So that means whoever did it to me and Tyser really want revenge. And with all these cactus being here... I can only imagine Chatch did it to him. But we just proved that someone framed me at Chatch's base... So that means it has to be Jimmy? Is someone trying to frame both him and... That means it has to be Jimmy, I think. I think I think it's Jimmy that did this. I am so confused. I don't even know what to think anymore. Someone has gone above and beyond at hiding their identity of who did this. I thought I had a foolproof way of figuring it out, but obviously I did not. And, well, might as well add to the fun, because whoever did this is going to get caught eventually anyway. So let's see here. If we go to the wand and hold F and we go to the portable hole and we just put a portable hole right, uh, I just put one right in the wall right there. Oh, see, it doesn't, I was hoping it would break the torch. That's unfortunate. Um, what if we just do one right here? Oh, that'll work. Get through that. Okay, well, I know it's temporary and all, but, uh, let's do something to Aaron's base just so he knows we mean business. He doesn't have to know necessarily we were the ones who did it, but as long as he knows there's someone out there who is going, who means business and means stuff. Oh, look at these wonderful turrets. Oops. Accidents happen. Whoopsie-daisy. Accidents happen, guys. I didn't mean to blow up his turrets. Wink, wink. 
Uh, so what we're gonna do is we gotta just make sure to, uh, I'm not gonna take his turrets. I'm not gonna be that guy who takes them. Um, cause when you kill my golem, I'm not sure if it respawns or not, but I'm not gonna take it. Where's his ME system? He can have his turrets back. I'm just gonna put him right. How do I even access his ME system? Can you leave, please? Can you leave, please? Look, Mr. Slime, I'm trying to be evil right now and you're not helping. There. That's not working. Okay, one minute. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There we go. Oh, now he's gonna turn into a bunch of slimes. Let him burn to death. Burn. Can I burn his base at all or no? It's only work on. Oh, I'm out of. Ah, I see. I'm out of a lot of resources. That's why I couldn't use the fire one anymore. Okay, look. I swear to God. You know I can't use the explosion one in here. Wait a minute. Okay. You die too. Here's what we do. How do I access an enemy system? I thought it was this glowy thing. Yes, yeah, the Emmy controller. Is that what we access? It's something else. No? What do we access? I thought it was this. Oh, I think it's something up here and it's blocked off by lucky blocks. Okay, so we'll just, uh, let's go ahead and break up here. Is this dirt? Oh, this is dirt. I should break this with my fists. Okay, so one minute. We gotta break this with our fists to get at his Emmy system. Right? Yeah? That the enemy system? Aha! There it is. He can have his turrets back. I want nothing to do with those things. And there was like an, a holder handle thing? I don't know if I have that. Anyway, that's all he's getting back from me though. I may be the evil guy, but I'll give his stuff back for now because it's also gonna help in not revealing that I did this. It also looks like someone cut down his trees, which is kind of weird. We'll just, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just blow up his trees then. We'll just blow those up. I can't. I'm out of resources. Right. Anyway, uh, never mind. I guess we're not doing that. So what we're going to do instead, guys, is we are going to basically uh, head back to our base, um, make sure there's nothing else on any of the other floors because we haven't checked them, and then we'll end off the episode there, and maybe you guys can give me some more information on who did this. Maybe you guys will have more information. So we'll figure that out in j a little bit. And okay, everyone. So we are back at the base now, and you can see we got doges, and if we go up, 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 there, there we go. Uh, nothing on this floor. Nothing on this floor, nothing on this floor, nothing on that floor, nothing on that floor, nothing on that. Oh, well, uh, that's my stuff on that floor. Now that that's changed, okay, everything's the same. On this floor, everything is the same. Up on this floor, everything is the same, except for this one broken bookshelf, which is going to bother me, so I'll have to fix that at some point. So it doesn't look like they really took anything. They just kind of killed my golem and disposed of him. So we're going to have to make more after this episode, guys, and um, that's really it. That's all we're going to do today. It doesn't look like they hit anything or left the other clues at the base unfortunately so we'll figure something out soon and hopefully uh hopefully that's sooner rather than later anyway thank you guys time for watching and as always stay beautiful and peace out